tutorial that's going to help you speed up your iPhone um, anywhere from 1 to 10 times. There's also an infinity option, but I haven't gotten a chance to try that out, and you do need a jailbroken device. So let's go ahead and get started with the tutorial. It's very simple. Open up Cydia. Say cancel. Or if you haven't refreshed in a while, go ahead and do so. Then go to the tweak named Speed Intensifier. Click install. And then click confirm. And it is installing. We're going to restart Springboard. Once that's done, type in your passcode. Once that is done, you want to go back into Cydia. You want to get the speed intensifier add-on. So let's go ahead and do so right now. There we go. Install. Confirm. This is done. Click return to Cydia. Click the home button. And your speed intensifier settings will be in settings. It's not like an actual app. Just scroll down to speed intensifier. And it'll say speed multiples uh, four, there's that little zero, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and infinity. Once you have your speed set, I'll just leave it at four. It says, please respring. But we're not going to do that. Instead, if you don't already have Winterboard, when you install uh, Speed Intensifier add-on, it'll automatically install Winterboard. So then, open up Winterboard, go to Select Themes, and uh, you can underclock, speed up, or overclock. So for max speed, of course, you would overclock. Or if you just want the speed up, you can just do speed up, but for this, uh, if you do both of these, that's what's going to get you the max speed. But your battery life may vary since it's actually overclocking your device. So if you want to maintain your battery, actually, honestly, I haven't met, uh, I haven't really experienced too many issues. But if you do have issues, you know, just uncheck it for now. I'll leave it checked. So overclock and speed up. Do not click underclock. That's just going to make your device slower. So once you have those two selected, hit the home button. Your device is going to respring. And your phone is going to be a lot faster now, or your iPod Touch, depending on your device, of course. So, there we go. Go ahead and install my passcode again. So, here it is. And now everything is going to be a lot faster. Of course, first you need to have the actual application load up. But once it is, uh, once it's running in the background, everything is going to be really, really fast. You can see how quickly this is opening. First time you open it, it'll take a little bit of time. Then once you open it, it's a lot faster. So this is how you speed up your iPhone or your iPod. Uh, if you like this tutorial, please hit the like button uh, down below. It'd really be appreciated, guys. Also hit the subscribe button above. And comment below let me know what you thought, uh, how it worked, if you have questions, comments, and I'll see you guys later. Please, again, hit the like button. Uh, that makes a huge difference. You know, I spend a lot of time doing these videos for you guys. So leaving the like button, leaving a like would really...